Good evening, everyone. Welcome to another night of insurance lesson. I do apologize for being a little bit late. Uh, this is Norm Morris coming to you live from the South Asheville Arden area. I'm with Cornerstone Senior Services, and tonight we are going to talk about dental. I did talk about it last night, made a great video, even had the great Taylor Langford working. Hard to believe, yes, but it did not upload, and I apologize for that. So we're going to review dental insurance tonight. Now remember, the purpose of insurance is to do one of two things. It is either to fix something or replace something that's been lost, broken, or stolen, and it is to prevent financial disaster. Excuse me. So, um, dental insurance. Why is dental insurance needed? What are the benefits of it uh, for you? One, for your health. Obviously, if you're going to eat uh, nutritional foods, it is harder to eat certain foods. If you are missing teeth, if you have uh, messed up partials, uh, gum disease. Two, speaking of gum disease, uh, that is linked to your heart health. So if you have poor gum disease, you could have poor heart health. Heart health. So that's where dental insurance comes in. Now, people always ask me, what do I need to do in order to um, get, you know, get the best bang for my buck with a dentist? Okay, couple options. One, you can always pay with cash. Sometimes dentists, like hospitals and doctors, will give you a discount. Two, you can do what's called care credit, which is a 0% interest card for up to 12 months. But if you don't pay that interest, you could pay a lot out of pocket. Three, you can do what's called a dental discount plan. You talk to your dentist, see if um, they belong to a certain network organization that does a discount with their, uh, with their procedures. And the last one is dental insurance. Works, you know, you go in there, you have a set copay, it pays so much, and you're good to go. Now, when looking at dental insurance, there's a few things you need to look at. One, you need to look at the deductible, how much you have to pay out of pocket before the pan, the plan pays. Two, you're gonna have to look at the premium. Is this plan too much for you to afford? Three, you need to look and see when the benefits go into effect. Spoiler alert, if the benefits for preventive care don't go into effect immediately, you need to get a different plan. Um, most plans do um, preventive care for day one. They do simple things like fillings and simple extractions within the first 90 days. And after one year, they do all majors, root canals, um, bridges, crowns, caps um, within the first year, after the first year. And the last thing you need to do is you need to see if your dentist is in network. If you get a plan and the dentist is not in network, no point of having that plan. Also, you want to see if your dentist is going to file the insurance. There's a lot of plans you can file it yourselves, but it does make it more convenient if you have a dentist that will file it for you. And finally, what is the cap on the dental insurance? Some of them go up to 1000 some go to 2000 There's one that I'm aware of that has no cap. It will pay X amount of dollars for, every, for certain procedures. So if you get a cleaning, it pays X amount of dollars. If you get a tooth pull, it pays X amount of dollars. If you get a filling, it pays X amount of dollars. But it has no cap, which is beneficial because if you have a lot of work you're going to see in a few years, that's the plan you need to go with. All right? So um, I think that summarizes dental insurance. If you need to talk to someone, please call me at my number, 828-400-1829. Thank you all for taking time to listen tonight. Always want to give a shout out to my small business friends out there down in my hometown, Rivard County, Florida. If your dog's getting hairy, hair's getting too long, smelling kind of funky, you know who to see. Miss Sarah Hale and Micah at Barks and Bubbles out in Brevard County. If you've messed up with your spouse and you need to get in good graces with your spouse, Go see Nunzio Mano at Florentine Jewelry off of A1A in Satellite Beach. He'll make sure that your spouse is loving you that night. And if you need help with your online business, go see Steve at Rock Your Business off of A1A in Satellite Beach. Up here in Western North Carolina, if you're needing help with um, listening to some good, wholesome music while you're driving the kids through Candler and Canton, turn to WPTL. Uh, Terrell Evans will make sure that you are listening to something good. If you're driving through Can uh, Canton and you want to grab yourself a cold one, Go to Langford's Grocery, say hey to Chandler, or sorry, Channing, sorry, I was watching Think About Friends, so I apologize about that, Channing. 
Uh, you want to see Channing, Taylor, Kyle, Faye, Teresa, if you are. Um, but remember to grab a cold one and make it a soda, not alcohol. But if you decide to grab alcohol, get a little tipsy. One, be polite to the police. Two, call Reinhardt Bail and Bonds, Chris Reinhardt, 24 hours a day. He'll make sure that you're sitting next to your spouse or your loved one rather than sitting in jail making new friends. And if you're needing help with your uh, if you're needing help with construction around the house and you want to expand that house, now's the time to lock in those low, low lumber prices. See Alex Hedrick at Yes Construction. Remember what the great Rob Winkle would always say, be kind, we're all fighting a battle. Came from Plato, not from himself. Go run an errand, do something nice, um, walk the dogs, go grocery shopping, simply go by and go, hey, let's be friendly to each other. Take care and have a good night. Bye-bye.